<laughs> Welcome back to Team Fat Kid Monday. We know it's been a while and we got a surprise for you today. Um, I came up with this one last night, guys. Oh, shit. We have no idea. Right. <laughs> so today's game is going to be Dollar Tree Date Night. Oh, God. <laughs> so oh, God. we're going to go to the Dollar Tree, purchase items, and then have to come back here. And each one of us will individually have to prepare a meal for the producer. Oh, shit. Which she will judge and pass judgment like she always likes to do. Her talking is... <laughs> right. <laughs> well, uh-uh. This not so here... Random. Nope. It's, I mean, it's going to be kind of sort of random. So here we have 7, 9, and 10. That's how many items we can purchase. So okay. we just throw those in there. Give that a shake. Dennis, put your fat hand in there. Figure out how many items we can purchase. And on this one... We got 15 minutes, 17 minutes, and 19 minutes. What'd you get? 10. So we can pick 10. And how long do we have to cook, Dooley? <laughs> 15. 15 minutes oh, with 10 items. <laughs> and is it going to be Mexican, Italian, or Asian? Is there Asian. anything you don't want? Give me Asian. Give me Asian. You want Asian? Dooley wants Mexican. Uh, All I'm right. Going, I'm going with producer. Already. I know. <laughs> like that's the, that's the easy way to do it. Yeah, that's the way to go. All right. Same time, I got a recipe already. It works. What is it? And it will be Mexican. Mexican. So we have 15 minutes to take 10 items for the Dollar Tree and make the producer a delicious Mexican meal. Get at it. Shall be fun. <laughs> okay. All right. So we are on our way to the Dollar Tree to pick up our ten items. All right. So here's the deal. We're gonna go one at a time. Uh, not shop in the kitchen because I thought it would yeah. only be fair that way. So anything you fuck up, you have to clean up for the next person. <laughs> it's the only fair way I could think of doing it. Santa and then to make it, <laughs> then to make it more fair. Since I know the producer the best, I'll go first. That way you guys have more time to think about what the fuck you're going to do. And then I will give her the meal while like, I do the dishes and clean up the kitchen for whoever's next. You guys can either civilly choose who goes next or we can draw straws, flip a coin. I don't give a shit after that. Uh, and then she's going to... She is going to make a pantry list, or not maybe not a list, but she's going to pull everything out that we are allowed to use food-wise in the pantry to help us because we obviously are not going to get salt at the Dollar Tree. Yeah. So salt and things of that nature, your normal pantry items, flour, uh, sugar, salt, pepper, and whatever else she deems will be allowed. <laughs> so like herbs and shit? Yeah, something like that. I'm sure she that's herbs to propose. Yeah, that's <laughs> that's her angle, man. Like she can she can throw some something in there that we have to use, which she's going to. Mm -hmm. So there will be at some point a mystery a, a mystery ingredient that has to be added into your she's, dish. She's, we're, we're experienced with this girl on TV. <laughs> what is this? Okay. A octopus? <laughs> You know, times are tough, man. Don't you know, call, babe. <laughs> you know, people don't have the 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 throw down date night money they used to have because they had to buy gas. Right. So we're doing a public service by going to the Dollar Tree to see if we can pull off a Mexican meal in ten items or less. I'm gonna have to get Mexican not Italian because I don't really think there's that much. Of I see, and I have not shopped for groceries at the Dollar Tree before. I mean, I've bought snacks. Like, I mean, they have chips and things of that nature. They got steaks. Oh, I would, I would serve one of those to her though. But you know, I have a feeling a lot of this could definitely be some uh, small cooking. Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> they already got burritos already made up. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking bussin'. <laughs> Melissa, I've made you this burrito. It's 
all handmade. <laughs> As it left, and it didn't even take me the full 15 minutes. <laughs> I took the liberty. I took the liberty of adding some refried beans as a side dish. So yeah, so it'll be fun. Like I mean, at least we got ten items. Yeah, I mean that's that should be an ample amount to. Oh, do we have to use all ten? No. Okay. But Julie, oh. I would recommend you buy all ten. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> whether whether look, just because you buy it doesn't mean you have to use it. That is a I rule. Want some snack ones later. <laughs> yeah, all right. <laughs> that is a rule in every cooking show. So, <laughs> just because it's there, unless someone says you have to use it, you do not have to use it. So, on our way to the dollar, <laughs> the dollar tree. There you go. It's working. It's working. That would be easier in a grocery store. Hell, a lot easier in a grocery store. We're just a uh, the the dollar tree doesn't have a lot of fresh produce. So, or any weird shit in there though. I was impressed with the pasta selection. <laughs> like, if we went Italian, that might have been easier. Right? I mean, they had gnocchi. They had gnocchi? Yeah. Shit. I mean, the quality. Yeah, it's right, like, yeah, but, but it, still. But I mean, like, Julie and I were talking, like, the dried pasta was probably fine. Yeah. Like, I just. Yeah, it's not that easy to go into the Dollar Tree and try to figure out how to make Mexican food. But he was laughing at me because I was like, shit, I need one more thing. And I ran back and I ran back and I'm like, it feels like I'm on Triple G. <laughs> <laughs> okay, for uh, my Dollar Tree date night dish, I am going to do, uh, right now, it looks like it's going to be a Mexican uh, breakfast burrito because I know the producer better than everyone else. I will go first. Um, and, um, you know, date night. But I believe you eat breakfast any time of the day. And breakfast burritos. So I actually stole this out of the box while the lady was stocking the shelf. So I got some, some beef patties. I got some cheese. Uh, eggs, which surprisingly enough are brown eggs from the Dollar Tree. Uh, they had some taco season. A little Sunny D for the beverage. And that's really it. So we're going we're gonna to work this together. Got some fried potatoes. We're going to see what we come up with in the next 15 minutes. Okay, what I made for you today was going to be a breakfast uh, burrito, uh, but then it turned into a, a queso burrito, but then it turned into a queso taco because the shells that I got at the Dollar Tree were not that good. So there's melted cheese in between two tortilla shells. You have your potatoes, your crispy uh, tortilla shells for the uh, texture. And I tried to make the eggs a little more creamy because we are lacking the sour cream. Bon appetit. Thank you. <laughs> All right, this is gonna be messy. You got the smallest plate possible too. <laughs> Thank you. Small plates make it look bigger. <laughs> so it hurts. <laughs> All right, this is huge. <laughs> Doug, look. It um. I didn't get too much, so I have to take have to take another bite. <laughs> okay. 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 Um. Thank you. Very. <laughs> <laughs> I got you some Sunny D to wash it down. <laughs> um. Which which spice did you use? Um, I used the bacon chive and the eggs. All right. Well, she's, I was gonna say she's going in for a third bite, so that's saying something. So. Yeah, <laughs> I just wanted to see if I could taste it in the egg, but I can't. Okay, dish number one. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to make a something. something. <laughs> it's probably going to be a chicken tamale taco. See, I just started grabbing everything that was Mexican. So, <laughs> um, so I got tortilla strips, uh, Spanish rice, and I got Melissa a drink, Doritos, Hornitos, whatever you call it. Taco sauce, avocado hot sauce, uh, refried vegan beans. 
Uh, the <laughs> chicken and chili sauce. Tamales. A uh, little bit of seasoning, and then our great looking uh, taco shells. So, let's get to it. <laughs> Don't mind me. My delicious chicken tamales. Are you throwing in there now? Refried beans? Yep. Vegan? They're not vegan anymore. They are not vegan anymore. <laughs> or so we think. <laughs> Alright. Um, so, this is a chicken tamale spinach rice taco thing with uh, avocado hot sauce on it and a little bit of actual taco sauce. Let's see here. It's got good crunch. <laughs> All right. Better first reaction than Jason's. Right? <laughs> okay, so for what I'm gonna make is I'm going to attempt some huevos rancheros for the producer because well, I've always wanted to make it. And so I got some tortilla chips, which I know usually you won't see that, but we do have the small tortillas. I have secret weapon, spicy chicken nuggets, just because it's the producer. I at least know that much. So sp uh, Spanish rice and then uh, some refried beans and everything, and I'm gonna try to do some. Uh, so, so I decided up eggs on top. So, what do we got going on over here? So, we got chicken going right now. Then, we got our uh, Spanish rice is cooking right now. Beautiful, very very beautiful. beautiful, very beautiful, very beautiful food. It's very beautiful food. I know how much my friends are here today when they say beautiful food. And of course, it's perfect timing. It's getting likely. <laughs> It's like my it. best friend. Friend. <clears throat> ten minutes. Ten minutes. Burn. <laughs> Go ahead. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so we've got huevos. Well, it's sure. supposed to be huevos rancheros, but. Unfortunately, I did not get that done in the amount of time that I had. So it's my classic play on a Mexican pizza belt without the cheese because I couldn't find the damn cheese at Dollar General. But we do have tree, uh, sir. Dollar <laughs> tree. Dollar twenty five, sir. Don't, um, don't cross up your dollar <laughs> stores. Dollar twenty five store, man. <laughs> dollar twenty five store. Anyways, um, but for the proteins and everything, we do have like we have uh, refried beans and we also have a uh, spicy chicken nugget chopped up and everything mixed in together and everything a little bit of the rotel with the hot and now trying to avoid as much of the hot stuff as i could and then uh some eggs and then a avocado salsa okay the eggs look good they look seasoned well Yay. presentations sloppy yes, up. well yeah, i see I it looks better than the other two <laughs> It's more refined. It's more refined. <laughs> more refined. It's, I was going to say. There's that, only so much presentation you can do with up. <laughs> There's only so much you can do in 15 minutes. It's not working. Yeah, evidently 15 minutes goes by very fast when you're in the kitchen. And oh, yeah. I'm not the only one who feels it. Okay. And those lights. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> Big ass bite. Mm -hmm. I did use some black garlic and uh, some tajin. Tajin, tajin. But I didn't go heavy handed on the tajin. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> it's good not to. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> I'm gonna spoil it. Yeah. Well, don't cover it with your hand. Yeah, right? All right. <laughs> All right, so uh, <laughs> after after the the Dollar Tree date night, um, date night. the the producer shall pass her judgment on to us. Oh fuck! And she said she's gonna go in order. So uh -huh. yep. let's have it. Say the worst for last. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So I don't think you can possibly be the worst in the league. There we go. <laughs> I set my standards high. Space bar. <laughs> you made breakfast tacos. I did. I attempted to. Yes. Okay. Very, very clever, knowing that 
breakfast tacos are one of my favorite dishes, and I always love breakfast. <laughs> that's, why, that's why. That's <laughs> why. That's why I said I would go first yeah. and give you guys time to think about it. Yeah. So okay, I uh, I really liked the eggs. They were cooked very well. They were very creamy. You know how I like my eggs. They were perfect. Though I couldn't taste your ingredient that you were supposed the to bacon use. Bacon chive. Yeah. Bacon chive or cheddar, whatever. It was chive bacon seasoning from McCormick that I put yeah, in. Yeah, I couldn't taste course. it. Now, whether or not that was because they it was kind of drowned out by the other flavors. Um, your <laughs> 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 like I really liked the corn chips that definitely needed to be in there. Everything was kind of one consistency, one texture. I liked the cheese in the middle of the tortillas. Very smart. It needed some acidity. Or you would have banked if they had sour cream. Did Dollar Tree not have sour cream? I didn't see it. I didn't see it. But I mean, uh, he found the cheese and nobody yeah, else found the cheese. I so. found cheese. Yeah, you guys I should have looked a little harder. I feel like that's. I just... don't know Dollar Cheese. Dollar Cheese. Dollar Tree cream. <laughs> sour cream? <laughs> yes, yeah, yeah. yeah, that's what I was going to say. Dollar know. Tree sour cream is where you want to be. No, not at all. <laughs> not at all. And I, should, right I definitely should have made that the you must use ingredient. See, you could sour. have you could have totally like everyone must use sour cream. Thank God. And then that would have saved a lot of dishes today. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. So I like that. I go vlog. Sunny D, thank goodness that was a very <laughs> delightful addition to it. And you could have totally added your own alcohol. We, we would not have passed judgment. Yeah, it would have been better if they did sell booze and I could have. Or if I had my own alcohol before this challenge. Would have been smart, too. Do for Dollar Tree shopping, it was del it was good. Delicious. It was good. Delicious is a stretch. Yes. Okay, so. Thank you, chef. Yes. So, <laughs> <laughs> it, it is what it is. I, I just, this is what I'm going to say, though. I don't know about that meat. I, I will no, pass. None of us do. I will pass forever on whatever that, that was. was. Yeah. Um, I mean, the Dollar Tree, the Dollar Tree Burger big, Patty big, big with patty. bacon and cheddar is not where it's at. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so you guys just go on and move past that when you're in the Dollar Tree. I mean, don't they sell frozen steaks? Don't they sell? I couldn't steak find. I was, I was. You were gonna have steak. Okay. So taste. No here's your. Here we go. Taste six. Out of ten. Out of ten. Plating. Three. Out of five? Yes. Oh, and gameplay out of five, you get a four. Thirteen out of twenty. Thank you. You're very welcome. <laughs> Moving on. Thirteen out of twenty. <laughs> <laughs> Saying thank you. Because <laughs> that was a dollar tree. <laughs> Moving on to Dooley. Dooley. Uh-oh. Tahin. <laughs> Tahin. That was all... Uh, one mush, one note, one flavor, <laughs> everything. <laughs> now, I will say, you did do the tortilla strips, which was good and necessary. The rice was cooked great for being out of the microwave. I feel like, though, you just opened a bunch of things and mushed it all together in a pan and then shoved it in a taco was, shell. <laughs> I was trying to mush it, but yeah. when I pulled it into tamales, it was already kind of mushed yeah. up. So, uh, you definitely went overboard on the seasoning. That was required, but you know, I, I tasted it. <laughs> <laughs> it was there. Uh, <laughs> yes, and um, you know, I probably, I will try chicken. Um, what are they? Tamales out of a can. We usually go with the beef, beef, but I will try chicken, whatever that was. I don't know if it's still beef. We don't I've know. I've never we seen those before. It was like chicken and chili yeah. sauce, so yeah. I don't know what. See, here's my theory on that. It's I was like, trying that to is... taste them separately, and they had it. It was, okay. I mean, it tasted like corn tamales. That is something that you're never going to see in a store because it's been discontinued for so long, and they're like, <laughs> they looked at, like, they found it, and they're like, oh, shit, this is going to go out of date, and, like, sell the dog tree. <laughs> <laughs> and then Billy found it, and he's like, fuck it. <laughs> now, this is a great Dollar Tree find. This is an amazing Dollar Tree find that did not make it to the plate. So, so you're not you getting saying? deducted. <laughs> I'm just saying that if you had made this and, and poured the tamales just on the plate, <laughs> it would have been better than what, <laughs> I mean, than what you did. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, <speak laughs> 
poetry shit, man. Love you, Dooley. <laughs> it's in my notes. I <laughs> love you. She had to write it down. <laughs> oh, sorry. Sorry, Dooley. Love you. That's what it says. <laughs> All right. All right, now on to Dennis. Uh, well, we didn't score. We didn't score. Oh, okay. Well, you can go past that. <laughs> <laughs> we can go past that. So what, like two out of 20? <laughs> One tenth of a good score. So. All right, so taste is a four. Okay. Plating out of five is a three. Just don't know how much more y'all could have done. It, it's Mexican. You yeah. plate too well. They just did a good Gameplay, job. you get two. So you got nine out of twenty. Almost fucking fifty percent. Almost. Um, okay. That's like my so <laughs> Dennis made the huevos rancheros. Well, we tried to at least. <laughs> his rendition of it, and it was it was good. I she I always wants to say the delicious. Then she I stops. Do, like, yeah. It was the uh huh. Yeah. It was it, it was, was there. there. It was there. It was there all the way. No, it was good. So the chicken nuggets, genius find. Right. Good yeah. gameplay. <laughs> Surprisingly added much needed texture. The eggs were seasoned well. Everything was a bit on the spicy side, but it was, was not overwhelming. He tasted the tahini, but it was not overwhelming. <laughs> Still, it needed a contrast of texture. Yeah. And had you gotten the tortilla chips on there, it would have been a game changer. I probably would have preferred the egg to be over yeah. just to kind of add that like creamy yeah. factor that I would be missing from sour cream yeah. or like a whatever else. But it was very good for what we had. <laughs> All right, so. Hey, girl, so here, what was that? <laughs> judging, okay, so your score. Taste, out of 10, seven. Wow. Yeah. Plating, out of five, three. Yeah. And out of five gameplay, you get a four, equally 14. Yeah! One point above Jason. <laughs> I still win with spirit. <laughs> Julie came to play. I, I came to play, and I had a good time. Here's your participation trophy. I don't want to accept that. <laughs> it will be a participation beer for you in the garage when we do the podcast. Team Fat can choose the fat. Once again, thank you guys for always watching. Yay! <laughs> I thought that was for me for participation. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The Covenant I, Dollar Tree Trophy. <laughs> I'm the kid over in the corner just. <laughs> I finally Once again, something. guys, thank you for thank you for watching this Monday. Congratulations to Dennis yeah. for winning the first Dollar Tree date night. We'll be back soon. Love you guys. Enjoy. Thanks for watching today, guys, and we hope that you enjoyed yourself as much as we did and maybe even learned a little something. Probably not. <laughs> maybe not. <laughs> but if you did, remember to hit the like and subscribe button, click the little bell until you get notifications when Team Fat Kid comes out with new videos. Don't forget to leave us a comment on anything we might have done right or, or wrong. Maybe something we didn't do right, that's right. Uh, we do answer the comments, so please do. All right, guys, uh, don't forget about our podcast, Team Fat Kid Choose the Fat. It's on every platform out there. If you want to check out our website, you can find us online at www.teamfatkidnation.com for any of your apparel or fat kid knife needs. Yeah, get you one of those cool Team Fat Kid knives. That's right. Until next time. Be creative. Stay hungry. And, and don't, don't forget, forget to sharpen, sharpen your knives. knives.